Hobby kids, how many times do I have to tell you? No turning everything we own into burgers. Hobby mom, you never told us that. Ah! <laughs> Hobby kids! Is anyone drilling? Not me. Did you leave the super slime blender on again? No way. I still haven't finished cleaning up from the last time. That's your stomach, Hobby Bear? What? Breakfast was ages ago. It's been 10 minutes. That's what I said. Ages. An early lunch isn't such a bad idea. Hobby kids, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Ha! Ha! Cosmo Burger! <laughs> Whoa! The line for Cosmo Burger is long today. I can smell the burger goodness from here. I'm gonna order a cheeseburger, fries, and a yummy milk. Well, if we get in line now, we'll probably still get our burgers in time for lunch. Next week. That's too long. No one makes burgers as good as Cosmo Burger. What are we gonna do? If only you had a genius brother who could build an invention that will help us skip the line. Oh, where can we get one of those? Oh, right. Those hobby kids should have gotten in line yesterday like us. Who do they think they are, skipping lines? Someone ought to teach those hobby kids a lesson. And by someone, I mean us. Follow them. But Slobby Rat, we're only one person Ooh. away from the window. We're starving. And everyone knows Cosmo Burger makes the best burgers in the universe. Hobby kids now, burgers later! Hobby kids, I am thrilled to present the latest Hobby Frog masterpiece, the Burger Blaster! Watch and learn. Aha! My vintage Super Trooper! Came with the original helmet too! That was worth millions! Mmm, but it sure tastes great now. It's burger time! Hobby kids, how many times do I have to tell you? No turning everything we own into burgers. Hobby mom, you never told us that. Well, we're telling you now. You need to get rid of the burger blaster. Come on, hobby mom. Let's get in the car. <laughs> hobby kids! It was fun while it lasted. Hobby Pig, pass me the Burger Blaster so I can dismantle it. I thought you had it. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the Burger Blaster, Hobby Kids! We gotta stop them! <laughs> Gaining on us. Get rid of the blaster! Grab as many burgers as you can and let's get out of here! <laughs> Whew, at least the burger blaster is safe. Uh, but look at the house! 
Hobby Mom and Hobby Dad are going to barbecue us. Oh, uh, where are they anyway? Hobby Mom? Hobby Dad? Hobby Mom? Hobby Dad? Oh, <gasps> Hobby Bros. It's Hobby Mom's beret. She never leaves without it. That must mean... Hobby Mom and Hobby Dad were turned into burgers! And the slobby kids took them. <laughs> Hobby Bear, get a hold of yourself. Since the popcorn incident of 2016, I build reverse settings into everything I invent. But what if they get eaten? <sighs> and how are we supposed to find them? They could be anywhere. With this BPS, Burger Positioning System. Look, the highest concentration of burgers are here. That's Cosmo Burger. Let's go! Get ready to feast on these delicious burgers, Slobby Kids! How do you know they're delicious? Cause they're stolen. <laughs> Give us back our parents, Slobby Kids! <laughs> no, we were too late. Hobby Mom, I never apologize for using your favorite necklace to power my diamond fuel jetpack. You did what? And there's my hat. You're alive! And not burgers! All your running around with that burger thingamajig got us in the mood to have burgers ourselves. And everyone knows that Cosmo Burger makes the best burgers in the whole universe. Let's eat! From now on, we only eat hot dogs! Dance, 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 dance. Ow! My floppy frog feet are too flat. Great job, Poppy Bear. You're a hamburger dance machine. You're not burger dancing from the heart, Hobby Frog. Guess I'm more of an inventor than a burger dancer, Hobby Bear. Hi, Hobby Kids. Hi, Hi Hobby Mom. Mom. What are you guys doing? Reading. Dancing. Falling on my frog butt. Well, I'm on my way home, and I have a special treat. Ooh, donuts! An hors d'oeuvres platter accompanied by just the perfect beverage? Nope, your favorite tuna broccoli lime marshmallow casserole. Yay! Wow. Yum. I knew you'd be excited. I'll be home soon. Gotta go pick up more tuna. I like it extra drippy. Bye. No! Not the casserole! Not the casserole. Not the casserole. Lime, tuna, broccoli, marshmallow! <laughs> we can't eat it. It's horrible. We can't tell her the truth. It'll hurt her feelings. I wish it tasted like anything else. Anything! Wait, that's it! Hobby Kids to the Hobby Lab? No, to the kitchen! I was working on this the other day, but didn't know what to use it for. I call it... The Flavor Fixer! Hobby Pig, grab that onion. If that onion could taste like anything, what would you want? Maybe fruit and apple. Okay, great. Open your mouth. Uh... Whoa! Now take a bite of the onion. <laughs> it tastes like an apple! <gasps> I want to try! I want this broccoli to taste like a hamburger. Oh my gosh, it works! Broccoli has become a glorious hamburger! We can use the flavor fixer for Mom's casserole! Problem solved! <laughs> Russell's sprouts are now candy! 
pass it back here. No, over here. We are on another turn. Guys, careful. What was that? I think we broke it. Can you guys taste anything? <laughs> I don't taste anything. Me neither. I think we might have zapped off our taste buds. What? No. <laughs> this means we'll never taste again. What about cake? <laughs> I don't feel anything. And this is the spicy kind. The spicy kind. <laughs> Stop! There's only one thing to do. We have to regrow our taste buds. Hobby kids to the Hobby Lab! Our taste buds are designed to read four different types of flavor. Sweet, bitter, sour, and salty. There's no time for tongue history. We have to act fast. What if we tried to jumpstart our taste buds by combining flavors? Like mix four foods that are sweet, bitter, sour, and salty? That actually might work. Oh, hobby kids, I'm home. And so is my tuna broccoli lime marshmallow casserole. Oh no, hobby mom's here. We'll never taste again. Not even mom's disgusting casserole. It's so nice having you all at the same table. You're normally off building and exploring. Dig in. What? I can taste this. I can too. Yuck. Yum. Yuck. Wow. I thought I would never taste again. Hallelujah. <gasps> you guys, it's the four flavors. They're all in this casserole. Bitter, salty, sweet, sour. Broccoli, tuna, marshmallow, lime. I love this casserole. I'm never going to wish anything tasted different ever again. So glad you guys like it. Want me to make it every day? No, no yes, yes, no, no yes, yes, so torn. I knew my kids had good taste. 968. 969. Yeah, you got it. All right, come on. You're only a few hops away from breaking the world record for jumping rope with your own arms. 978. Phew. 979. Uh-oh. He's getting tired. Careful, Hobby Frog. You'll hurt your arms. I'm not gonna hurt my arms. Oh, I hurt my arm. Oh, rats. I should have gotten that on camera. Oh, man, that looked like it hurt. Uh, I mean, grr, those hobby kids. I wish the whole world could watch them fail. <laughs> Slobby skunk, you're right. We have to make sure everyone sees them mess up. Next time they even think about trying to break a record. We'll record it and put it on the internet. You know what that means? Slobby Stakeout! <laughs> I can't believe I broke my arm. I can't believe you didn't break the record. Not helping, Hobby Bear. It's always been my dream to get into the awesome Book of World Records. But you only checked this book out from the library yesterday. It's always been my dream since yesterday. Hey, I know it's your dream, but maybe we could break a world record together. What do you think? We think, think yes! yes. <laughs> All right! <laughs> yeah! Hang on. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Slobby kids, prepare to capture humiliating video of the hobby kids failing. Yes, then we'll upload to our YouTube channel and we'll be famous. The views, the likes, we're gonna go viral, I can feel it. <laughs> <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.
Actually, are a pig. A real pig. Uh, I can't believe we only ate one watermelon. Our videos, they're trending. Yes! Our slabby plan! It's working! I know what world record we broke. World's biggest stomach ache. I thought we'd build a real legacy. Together. Build? That gives me an idea. Testing. One, two, three. <laughs> Does my hair look wet? I can't believe the hobby kids decided to fail in public. But where are they? Oh! oh. Give it up for the Hobby Kids! I'm your host, O Fishel, the official fish official from the World Record Association. Today, we're here to watch the Hobby Kids make history. Today, we're going to break the world record for being the first pig, bear, and frog to build a brother pyramid in under one minute. Whoa, specific. You have one minute and go. <laughs> Oh, Hobby Bear, why'd you wear your banana peel shirt? Well, I like the smell of bananas. Are they seriously messing this up? We're losing time! Just jump on! <laughs> hey, control your jump, Hobby Frog! Ten more seconds! Can they do it? <gasps> Kids are official world record holders. Congratulations! What? But we failed. Exactly. This is an award for most ever failed world record attempts. We saw all of your videos online. Yay! They saw our video. And oh boy, did you fail a bunch. With all those failures, plus this one, you've officially not broken more world records than anyone. <laughs> well, that's it for me, folks. I'm a fish and I need to get back to the water before I dry up. Congrats, hobby kids! We won! Well, we failed, but we won! Uh, they won an award for losing? <gasps> Curse you, Internet! If we hadn't uploaded those videos, no one would have ever seen the Hobby Kids. I'm never uploading a video again. Slobby Kids, Slobby Stomp Away. Can I Slobby Slither? I have a hard time stomping. Whatever! This is cool and everything, but... There's one more award you guys should have won. Really? What? For being the best brothers ever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, hobby friends. Do you think Hobby Pig can do the robot? Check out this playlist to see all of our other Hobby Kids adventures. They're amazing. And don't forget, subscribe and hit that notification bell so you won't miss next week's episode.